Hello everybody, and it's Cody3751, and welcome finally to part 3. I know it's been awfully crazy, I've been doing a lot of model railroad videos lately, and I know you guys are getting tired of this, but why don't we just uh, explain what just happened uh, in the last two parts in case you're watching this third part first for some reason. Uh, the first part we unboxed this locomotive and this locomotive. And it's part two, I'm going to box this locomotive, and there's two of them. In fact, it's right there. That's the second one. I'll show you what I mean. Same thing, just a different number. So, these are the two or three locomotives I have. These are just representation. For, for, for representation purposes only, these two three locomotives. So, uh, again, we're going to be talking about historical reference. Uh, this one uh, is a couple of GP7s, Jeep 7s. Just get that off there. I gotta be really careful because these are fragile. Uh, in fact, uh, I had one with a little problem when I accidentally dropped it. So it just, I mean, dropped didn't drop it very far, but it was in the box. But it was very fortunate it still runs. But anyway, that's just how fragile these things are. So you gotta be really careful. So, uh, limited edition GP7, same thing as earlier, except. These are, uh, I would say, uh, kind of uh, interesting because the book that I read back in the day, of course, same, is also, which also features this locomotive, I mean, this, this particular railroad, is also features this railroad, which is the Chicago Northwestern. So, uh, uh, I, that's why I bought it. So, it's, so I'm just going to get it out of this box, so you know. So you can see it. That's the same thing, basically. Now, what's interesting about this number, that the numbers here, is that it's got the same markings on it. And can you guess, and I bet you guys don't, can never guess who this belonged to. So, for you Columbia Gorge guys or Longview, Pelson, Rainier guys out there, let me just get some chance here. For you guys that are that know who this is, as you saw in the last video, uh, I'm gonna have to cut the camera and we'll be right back. Okay, as I was saying earlier, this uh, for all you Gorge, Plumbing Gorge Model Railroad Club guys or LKNR Club guys, this is the uh, person it belonged to. Is Club Number 84. So tells you um, this was owned by somebody else, but that's going to have my number on there, uh, probably, you know, over that or something, I'm not sure what, but anyway, that's just, just kind of personal story, but, you know, it's, I bought this from him as well, kind of, well, in, indirectly, but I bought it from him, so, uh, I might be wondering what the other one is, well, it's the same thing, it's just a different number, I'll show you what I mean in a second here. So this is number 1519, it's the same thing. So I'm not, it doesn't really make sense to stick it out of its box to, because it's, I've done it once before. So I'm gonna try to get this done as fast as possible, just so you know. So as I so you know, there's a lot of stuff uh, accumulating off camera, it's ridiculous. This is ridiculous. So uh, four locomotives so far, uh, one, two, three, four, two units and two Jeeps. So we're gonna have a third one on the, on the so uh, just a reminder, uh, put those locomotives on the side there for representation purposes only. It just tells you that each one by chronological order. This one in the front, this one, next one, next one, and after that. So, final locomotive, guys. Uh, one thing I no <laughs> noticed is that this has the original uh, tag on it from like when it was first purchased. So it tells <laughs> it tells you just how much time it has spent so this is the southern uh southern yeah southern uh locomotive uh this is uh not sure what this has but we're gonna find out pretty quick here let's try to open this up get out of this box here trouble pcc Oh wow, it does have DCC, alright, so, 
got something out of this. It's got some really nice... Oh, wait a minute. This already came with DCC. So why don't we just get right to it? Oh my goodness. That's a beautiful look mud. Look at that. Let's take a look at it. Just gotta be really careful. Gotta put it right in front so you guys can see. This is a really nice locomotive, if I can tell you what. I'm sorry I've been rant ranting for way too long, I know that. It's got really nice stuff. Wow. <laughs> anyway, so sorry I've been taking so long. I think I gotta clean all this mess up, but anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe for more stuff. Thanks for watching this whole series. If you stuck around this long, and I will see you guys later. This is Cody 3751. Ride safe. Shoot. Man, it's unbelievable.